morning guys happy Friday it's Friday which means double payday for me so I'm pretty happy about that um, I have to pick up groceries today at Walmart I'm still really tired although I slept much better last night I might have another coffee um, but I have to pick up groceries when Reese wakes up from her nap I have the biggest load of laundry to do that you've ever seen in your life and I want to I'm just eating some boiled eggs And I want to sweep, wash the floor, um, and this afternoon do some baking because I have to go pick up like the butter and all that stuff that I ordered. Um, and yeah, and Olivia got into my makeup this morning. She took my eyeliner and she put it like on her face, but she drew it like right here. So she has a Hitler mustache. Toddlers. Before I get going too, I am still crampy today and bloated. Just, it's nothing, it's on my computer. Um, it's nothing that I ate, but yeah, I'm just still bloated and crampy. So, could just be nothing. It could be nothing. It's nothing. There's, although I did read, sorry if this is TMI, but they said, so again, we didn't get Colin's swimmers tested to make sure the vasectomy was successful <coughs> i know dumb but i figured whatever it's <laughs> meant to happen it's meant to happen um but apparently they need to be cleared out like 20 times so. i'm just shaking out the red right thing Well, we will be on our way shortly to um, see Livy back there um, to get do pick up at Walmart, and um, Livy just wants me to put on Chicken Little for her. And I am gonna run into Walmart just to get Blake. She has like festive day at school next week because it's their last week before Christmas break, so I have to get her um, a little festive thing to wear to school, and then. Um, I wanted to get some wrapping paper. So I can finish some wrapping. Or I could go to the dollar store for that. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. We'll just, we'll see how it goes. But anyways, we're going to go get our groceries now. And we'll take you with us. I promise I'll bring you to Walmart this time. Okay, we just got back from Walmart. Olivia's having her lunch there. Look at all this stuff. And Reese is gnawing on a um, strawberry. Let's fix your hair. You got like old man hair. Here we go. Um, so I'm gonna do a quick grocery haul. So I got two things of green leaf lettuce. By the way, this was only $165. Blew my mind, because we're used to spending like 350 to 400 at Costco every week. So might need to switch that up. Um, romaine lettuce. I got butter. Um, I butter. For, oh, oh, here. Here's another one, honey. Yeah, those ones aren't washed though. You can have these ones. Obviously, I got strawberries, because the girls are eating strawberries um so butter for baking cream cheese i'll cut it off honey um whole fresh cranberries orange juice let me cut it oh god libby don't do that honey you could cut me or you no this got the peel there you go oh and you gotta have your yogurt too so we got um lily dale turkey oh, strawberries <laughs> um two things of cucumbers and right there Two things of green onion, um, apples. I saw this, caught white chocolate mocha Starbucks creamer. I'm gonna try that. Uh, bananas, avocado, um, iceberg lettuce. I thought these, the girls would like these. They're gingerbread Greek yogurt. So you wanna have one of those? Mommy, I want, chips. I want bananas, okay? I'll get you a banana. 
clementines. I got fruit pouches for Reese Bear, ones that have no banana because she can't have banana. Um, sponges, Dawn, these little holiday chippets for baking. Uh, three packs of fruit pouches for the older kids. Actually, Reese could have these because they don't have, um, they're organic. She, they don't have um, banana. These ones do. I want to, uh, um, I want to sit down. Okay, honey. Oh, Protein God. up bread. Yeah. What else did I get? I'll put the tea down for you in just a sec, honey bunny. Yeah. Um, and then crackers. This is for baking that I'm going to do later today. Coffee and eggs. And then I'll show you what I got Blake after. So I'm just doing laundry, but before I threw this in, I thought I would show you guys. I got... So Blake has two festive days next week. Um, so I got her this Santa's Little Helper shirt and I got one for Liv too, obviously. Um, and then I got her this dress for the other day. It was only $6 and it's so cute. I mean, the head, these were more, these were eight <laughs> for the little um, festive scrunchies. So that's what she's gonna wear. And now I gotta get the girls to bed and start some baking. The girls are in bed. I'm just going to start with some of my baking. So I'm going to do these uh, best ever Christmas crack because it looks super, super easy. So I'm going to get started with those. And I've got all my ingredients here and away we go. Okay, so I have my large baking sheet and I'm going to, I lined it with aluminum foil. I'm going to spray just to make it easy to come off. And then you're going to line it with these um, saltine crackers, about one sleeve. So now we are gonna melt a cup of butter and a cup of brown sugar <clears throat> on the stove. And you wanna bring it to a roaring boil and we're gonna continue, like continuously stir it. So I poured the stuff over top, the um, butter and the sugar, and it makes it like a candy. And then you're supposed to put a whole package of chocolate chips over top. Um, and I did put this in the oven for five minutes. And then you kind of let that sit and then you can try and spread it a little bit. You let it sit for a couple minutes and then um, like spread it around. I think the corner pieces are not gonna get a ton, but that's okay. And then I just put some pretzels in a bag and crushed them with a potato masher. And I'm just gonna sprinkle that on the whole thing. Stuff like this is like my crack. Like I could eat a whole sheet of it. And by the way, I'm still crampy. Um, I don't remember having this last time we were intimate. Um, I don't know, I can't really remember, but I don't remember this last time. So I don't know what the heck is going on, but it's weird. I feel like there's like a boulder in my stomach. And then I found these vanilla chippets. Um, they're like Christmas, um, you know, Christmas. I'll show you. Christmas, not flavor, what am I trying to say? Themed. So see, it just looks like that. And there's like little, um, stockings and Christmas trees. So I'm gonna spread that all around. That looks so good. So next I'm gonna make cranberry, um, cranberry orange shortbread cookies. So um, I got, I showed you guys the cranberries. So I'm going to chop these up um, and then we're gonna, I'll show you how to do the rest. So I've chopped up my cranberries. They're just right there. And I've got um, a cup of butter, half a cup of sugar, and orange zest. It's under the butter, it's like right there. And then you wanna put it, if you don't have a food processor, then you could just use like a like a um, electric whisk thing. What's it called? <laughs> I don't even know, but you know what I'm talking about. Um, or just like combine it yourself. But um, I'm going to make this into like, I think it said a paste, not a paste, but like cream it together. So I'm gonna do that now. Now I've added my two cups of flour and I'm supposed to do a teaspoon of vanilla extract but I forgot that I ran out and I forgot to buy some more classic Lindsay. So um, I have a teaspoon of maple syrup in there because apparently that works and you're just supposed to pulse it about 10 times. So we're going to try that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
10. Then I add the cranberries and pulse until they're distributed, but it said not to pulse too much. So I added the cranberries, and so just lightly pulse it, but not too much. <laughs> Okay, I think, I'm, I think that's it, because it said not too much. Okay, and then you can mix this all um, into a dough, and then we're gonna flour, like roll it out. Am I making sense? We're gonna roll it out. <laughs> no longer crumbly. So we gotta work this until it's no longer crumbly. So I'm gonna make like a dough mountain. I really should roll up my sleeves. There is my beautiful log. So I'm gonna wrap this in foil and then put it in the You guys have to make this. It is to die for. It's so good. Um, I put um, pretty much, well, all of the, what you don't see went to the freezer. Um, it is so, so good. I can't stop eating it. It's so delicious. You need to make it. Trust me, it's so good. Look at Blakey's pictures from kindergarten. Oh my God. So cute. I know a lot of you say she looks like Colin, and she does. She has Colin's eyes, but she's my child. That's me when I was little. Oh, wait, one thing. One sec. That's me. Sorry for my kids in the background. <laughs> I think she looks like mommy, but also Colin a little bit. 